Hello guys and welcome to the video. In today's video I will show you how to create a transition with just simple masking. If you want to learn Premiere Pro and other stuff like that, consider subscribing to the channel for more videos like this one. Today, as I said, I will show you how to use masks for transitions in Premiere Pro. It's really a cool way to connect two shots and to create some cool looking videos. So let's jump into Premiere. Now we are here in Premiere Pro and we have two clips. One where a car is passing in front of the camera, I zoomed it a little bit so it covers the whole scene. This is really important to remember because it's not going to work if the object is not covering the whole scene. And I have another shot of a city here for the transition. It's better to use shots that are going in the same direction because it looks much smoother. Now place the clips in the different video tracks and in the first shot find the place where the line of your mask is all the way through the frame and cut the clip there. And now place the second clip uh, where you want to line up the clip or the mask to start. And where they are all lined up perfectly you can start masking. Click on the first clip Go to effects and controls, go to opacity and grab the pen tool. That will automatically create a mask. And now draw a mask around your object. And now you can see that the second clip appears. To change it, just go under your mask option and click invert it. Now go again to your mask option and activate all the keyframes of the mask. Put a little bit of feather for more smoothness. Now go frame by frame and just correct the mask until your second shot is all the way out. When you're done, you will notice a black part of the beginning of your clip, and that's the mask. Just go frames before the transition starts and just move the mask away. I think that this is okay, let's see. And it looks awesome. I will add some sound effects and a color grade to the clips, and this will be the final result. And basically that's it, that's how you use masks for some cool transitions in Premiere Pro. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like it and don't forget to subscribe to the channel and I will see you next time.